on this fine day. I almost said this fine specimen day. In this video, we are going to talk about the properties of matter, specifically the physical and the chemical properties. Recall that matter is anything that occupies space and has mass, right? So if you can see, touch, smell, taste, or feel it, then it's matter. Now, what are properties? Properties describe how an object looks, feels, or acts. Remember that all properties of matter are classified as physical or chemical. So let's talk about physical properties first. A physical property can usually be observed with our senses. Physical properties include color, which is the quality of an object or substance with respect to the reflection of light. We also have size, or the overall dimensions of an object. Next is volume. It is the amount of space a substance or object occupies. And we also have density. So density, again, is the ratio of mass and volume in a substance. Physical properties also include boiling point or melting point, which is the temperature at which something boils or melts. We also have magnetism. It's whether or not something is magnetic. Lastly, we have solubility or how easily something dissolves in another substance. Physical properties are broken down into two different categories. We have the intensive and the extensive property. I have another video for this, but to give you an overview, intensive properties do not depend on the amount of substance present. Extensive properties depend on the amount of matter being measured. Now let's go to chemical properties. A chemical property is any characteristic that can be determined only by changing a substance identity, possibly through a chemical reaction. Chemical properties include reactivity with other chemicals. It is the likelihood of a substance to undergo a chemical reaction. We also have toxicity or how poisonous or damaging a chemical substance may be to an organism. We also have flammability. It is whether a substance will burn when exposed to a flame. And combustibility. Okay, combustibility is the measure of how easily a substance will burn in oxygen. Okay, here's a simple organizer in determining properties of matter. So you just have to ask yourself, can the properties be identified without changing it? If your answer is no, then it is a chemical property. If it's yes, then you are describing a physical property. Thank you. Thank you.